Assalamu alaikum and hello everyone. My name is Nur Atika Binti Zamri. Student ID 9203152053 states 001. And I live at Sungai Putani, Kedah. My course is uh, OUMH 131303 English for Oral Communication. My learning center at OUM Sungai Putani. Today, I'm excited to share with you all the vibrant world of batik, focusing on the art of batik coloring. Before I present about batik and why I choose the title of batik as my assignment, because day one day I went to the MMF event at Sungai Putani, which is its Muda Mundi Festival, Center Square, Sungai Putani. There are so many stores there, such a food, drink, jewelry, clothes, and the most important is, I'm interested in a one store batik. It's a full many people who are the coloring batik and that's why I took the opportunity to learn about batik and how learning about coloring for batik. Let me show you this video. Batik, of, batik coloring is the final and the most important step in batik making. It transforms the wax pattern into a breathtaking piece of art filled with meaning and the culture significance. In this speech, I will describe the tool, technique and step in the batik coloring. The process of batik coloring involves applying dyes on the fabric to highlight the integrate pattern draw with the wax. The color not only make batik visual appealing but also hold symbolic meaning, reflecting culture story and tradition. For batik coloring, fabric dry, available in liquid or powder form. Vibrant color are used, such as indigo, gray, and gold. Wet resistant fabric, cotton or silk is typically used as the base. Brush or dye buckets, depend on whether you are hand painting or deep dyeing the fabric. Wet for pattern locking, this is this ensures that cutting area resists the dye. Yeah. Coloring. Step 1. Prepare the fabric. After drawing the pattern with the wax, the fabric is ready to be the dye. Step 2. Apply the dye. Depending on the design, the artist can another dip the fabric in a dye bulb or paint directly into it with the brush. Step 3. Repeating the dye process. To create multicolor design, the wax is refined to cut the area and the fabric is thick dyed in additional dye bulb. Step 4. Remove the wax. Finally, the fabric is the ball to remove the wax, revealing the finishing body design. Batik color is not just about aesthetic. Color has meanings. For example, in Indonesian batik, red is symbolizes bravery, while a blue signifies peace. In Malaysia, batik often incorporate bright tropical colors reflecting nature beauty. In conclusion, batik coloring is a delicate process that requires skill and passion. Whether through deep dyeing or hand painting, each a piece tells a unique story through its vibrant colors. I hope this piece has given you a deeper appreciate for the art of the body coloring. Next time you see a body
party very very take a moment to admire not only the pattern but you also the color that 